I know, some of you may not be very comfortable with installing community extensions on your GNOME. But you're making two big mistakes, I believe. First, there are extensions that can really make your experience with GNOME so much better if you give them the chance. And second, there are extensions that deliver features that GNOME wants to implement upstream. So, in a sense, by using specific extensions, is like you're using future GNOME versions. And this is such an extension I'm gonna show you today. But before, it is very important to learn about this merge request. It basically does two things. One, because the indicators are now loaded async, it will try to place the extension controls at the proper positions. And two, it gives a small example how extension developers can use it. And the caffeine extension has already hooked up for the new API, which guarantees that it won't mess up with the rest UI elements in our panel or even on the quick settings placeholder. By the way, the support of GNOME 45 is still not merged, but something amazing that I have noticed in many extensions is that the PRs are coming from contributors rather from the extension's maintainers. To put it simply, this shows a great interest from the community about the extensions. Especially Caffeine is an extension of a great usefulness that might be among the top 10 most popular ones, and here's why. Very often we need to disable the screensaver, and to do so, we need to open the settings, then power, and set blank screen option to never. But of course, later we'll get super lazy, and we'll never revert the change. Not only we are going to waste more energy, but it's also a significant privacy issue to forget our session unlocked. The good news is that we have a merge request open for adding a stay awake toggle on Core GNOME. It looks identical to Caffeine extension, and if you like the feature, don't miss to thumb it up. Going through the thread, I can tell that the GNOME devs are not negative for adding it, but before they overpopulate that menu, it needs to implement a configurable quick toggles UI first. Till then, that might be like never, you can safely enjoy Caffeine that comes loaded with some pretty cool options. Oh, if you enjoyed the movie, please put a like. It's kinda a stupid thing to ask, but it actually works.